so welcome back to Catch Fish Not Feelings. I'm here in Long Beach fishing off the jetty. I got two setups with me today. Shit, it got all tingled. But pretty much, I have one rod with a dropper loop, and I'm gonna throw out bait with that one. And another rod, I'm gonna be casting out lures. So this is the lure we're using today. It's, um, I forgot the name of it, but what it is is like, there's a hook underneath the, the fins, like hidden in the fin, just so it doesn't get caught on rocks. But when a fish bites onto it, you know, it's gonna push the fins down and it's gonna get hooked right there. Yeah, well, we're gonna be casting out. Hopefully, we catch some like bass or something like that. Got the homie Aaron right there. Hi, Hi, guys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And for our bait, we're gonna use shrimp. Let's go. Let's go catch fish, not feelings. All right, so whenever you guys are out there fishing, you know, either if it's on the jetty, the shore, or wherever it's really important to kind of observe how the birds are behaving as well. So you can see in the background here that there's birds flying back and forth and there's even some birds diving down. And you know, that should click that, you know, something is going on out there. You know, there's some sort of feeding frenzy where the bait, there's bait fishes out there. They're being chased by something that's causing a little feeding frenzy. And that's just a sign that maybe you should change your lure or like try casting out there or anything that might help you help you catch fish. And so the lure I was using at first is meant for, you know, just jigging off the bottom. So after seeing all this going on, I changed my lure to a lucky craft. And you know what? I managed to land a first a fish on the first cast. And you know, later in the day, we even saw like little boils like close to us too. And you could, we could see like fins of like maybe bonitos or like big mackerels out of the water as well too, which is pretty cool. But definitely when you're out there, pay attention to the birds because it might help you. Oh yeah, got one. Fish on, let's go. Alright, let's go home. Wait, record. Are you recording? Yeah. Fish on. What is it? The barracuda or what is that? Macro? Oh. <laughs> Got a big macro. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of fat. Yeah. Oh, First fish of the day, big macro. Oh, shit. I don't want to drop him in the rocks. Here, you want your towel? Nah, it's okay. Mackerel. We saw like I was seeing a lot of um, a lot of birds diving down for bait, and so I'm assuming there's like you know barracudas or something chasing like bait fishes around. Well, yeah, got a mackerel. First time catching one on the Lucky Craft. Yeah. At least so. Yeah. This one's pretty big too. Yeah, he's fat. He's not. There he goes. I've never caught a bear, a, a mackerel on a lucky craft. Really? Yeah. Dude, that was the first cast of the lucky craft. I know. Macro's one's a little bigger, I think, or a little longer. Yeah, he's a little bloody right now, but he doesn't have eternal bleeding. It's just like around the lips, so he should be fine. Yeah. 
Okay, we lease out. Yeah, I don't think they would because we do like pipeline design and the coastal engineering stuff isn't really related to that. Yeah. Cut something. Fish on, let's go. Barracuda. Hey, lift it. Lift it? Oh shit, he's fighting. <laughs> oh my god. Dude, I need to get down. Oh yeah, you got it? You wanna net it for me? Yeah, I got it. I have like eight pound line, dude. Thanks, babe. Ooh, it looks like I hooked it tough too. Yeah, you might have to get down to uh, this rock right here. Let me. Oh my God! Please, where is he? Hey, do I Try going to this rock, the one on your left? Yeah. You need me to lift it up or anything? Uh, just guide it with my neck. Hey, let's go! Teamwork makes the dream work! Yes, sir! Alright. Okay, let's uh... Here, I can just start getting up. Yeah. <laughs> it's so funny you moved the camera though. Yeah, I thought it was the other way around. Like, oh, I wonder if you forgot. Let's get. I'll walk over there. Anyone, yeah, I'll go over there. It's all good. Oh, he came out. It's good. Oh, he came out. The hook came out. Uh, Barracuda, let's go. Looks like he's about maybe 18, 20 inches. 20 inches maybe. But oh, look at the teeth on this guy. Yeah, nice one. I'm gonna release him. You want to measure him? Oh. I don't know if you want to keep it. Yeah. Let's go release some. Hit from here, huh? Sorry. Yeah. I'm hoping he'll come up. He's somewhere. Honestly, that barracuda was pretty fun to catch because um, I was using like eight pound line. So we had to get the net and everything. I was scared it was going to snap. But we landed it thanks to his net. By the time I already used it. Oh, I could, uh, out here, Aaron, he didn't catch anything. But. <laughs> <Just kidding. laughs> yeah, out here fishing with the homie Eric. Or Aaron, he didn't catch anything, but you know, he caught feelings, so you know, it's okay. He caught something at least. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I thought I wasn't in it. Yeah, you're in it. <laughs> oh, I'm so, today was a pretty good day. I, um, I've been getting skunked like four days in a row, so today was really nice catching something at least. But this was definitely the lure of the day. Oh shit. Little golden lucky craft right here. Caught two mackerels and a barracuda. So I think we'd fish, I don't know, it was at an incoming low tide, I think. But yeah, that barracuda was probably like 18, 20 inches. The legal size is 28 inches, but I wasn't planning on keeping any fishes and everything we, uh, we released. But yeah, it's a good day. It was good to be catching fish again. Till next time. I guess not. I'm gonna eat this one. Catch a release. Catch a release.